Have you ever wondered what exactly space and time are? They are often thought of as silent observers, the stage upon which the cosmic drama unfolds. But what if they are more than just passive spectators? Imagine a trampoline. When you place a heavy ball in the center, it creates a dip or depression. This is similar to how space and time work. Massive objects like stars and galaxies warp the fabric of space-time, creating a sort of indentation. This warping, this curvature, is what we perceive as gravity. But the effects of this curvature are not limited to gravity alone. It bends and twists the path of light, causing it to curve around massive objects. This accounts for the phenomenon of gravitational lensing, where light from distant stars appears distorted as it passes a galaxy or a black hole. Time isn't a standalone entity either. It's linked to space, forming a four-dimensional continuum known as space-time. The flow of time is relative, changing based on the observer's motion and the distribution of mass and energy nearby. In effect, time can slow down or speed up depending on your point of view. What does this all mean? It suggests that space and time aren't fundamental entities, but emerge from a deeper underlying structure. This idea has led scientists to explore theories like quantum gravity and string theory. These theories aim to merge general relativity and quantum mechanics into one coherent framework. So space and time are more than just the backdrop to the universe's events. They're active participants, influencing the behavior of matter and energy at every level. Their interconnectedness, their warping, is fundamental to our understanding of the universe. As we delve deeper into the cosmos, we may discover even more surprising insights into the nature of space and time, revealing the hidden threads that tie together the fabric of our universe.